Hello, it's me, it's Shox Whipper. What's up? Uh, so we're here at New York Comic Con. This is my first time ever going to a con, and we're gonna go on in. Uh, we're gonna see what it's what it's all about. I'm very excited. You know, most of my life I've been working rent fairs, which means whenever there's a con, I can't go because I'm working on the weekend. And so this is my first time, it's my first experience going to one, um, working or as a fan. So come on down, let's go see what there is to see. How are you? How's it going? You want a picture? Yeah, beautiful. Wonderful. You. You're very welcome. I love I love the fits, everyone. It's become so much more frequent over the last year, everywhere except Boston, which is honestly just perfect. So we made it inside. I got my lanyard. Uh, I busted out my old WBUR press pass lanyard because we didn't have a whole lot of lanyards, and I was like, you know what? Let's uh, let's let's rep the old fit. We're inside. I don't know. I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do. But we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna mosey around. We're gonna see what we got. At Spider, sponsor me. Do you know what the worst part is? I have two of these shirts too, just in different colors. Spider, sponsor me. Lucky Jeans, sponsor OSP. So how you doing? Yes. Here, I got you. I got long arms. I got the long arms for this reason. I don't believe for a second that's a mannequin. I'm pretty sure that's an actual person because that's exactly what Deadpool would do, is pretend to be a mannequin, but not actually be a mannequin. I feel like people are about to learn just how awkward I am one-on-one -on -one in real life. Yeah, you're not on stage now. I'm not on stage. I can't, I can't, I can't do the accent. I can't just be like, oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Did you build that yourself? Yep. How long did that take you? About five years. Five years? Yeah. So what's the what's the? It's the point that you control. That's amazing. I love that. Can I touch them? Absolutely. All right. Okay, can I touch it? So it's all aluminum. Good frame on the inside. Yeah. Oh, that's all. Oh, right. Oh, God. Oh, God. Praise Joseph. So we're in the cosplay section and everyone's like, Shock, what are you going to cosplay as when you go? And I was like, I don't know if I have the time to make a cosplay. I did not have the time to make a cosplay. Um, but I did find uh, something today that I think, you know, I think will make me cosplay, you know, ish. And that's, uh, I, can, I can just be myself. That'll work. Hello. I can cosplay myself incognito. It's great. And the best part about this one, it doesn't smudge when I wipe it because it's Sharpie, not eyeliner. Why is it salty? She's taking a break. So I just signed up for my very first Street Fighter tournament. Because I've been a Ryu main since I was like six years old. I'm fine at Street Fighter. I'm not a pro or anything like that. I am very excited to try myself against the people who play this game way too much. Uh, probably get my ass kicked in the first round. So every match is a best two out of three. My goal is to win one of those, those rounds. Not even win the match, just win one round. Apparently they got a pro playing, you can challenge the pro, try and beat the pro. Uh, I have no expectation that I can do that, but I was like, you know, well, we're here, we're waiting, I put my name in, we'll see uh, if I can survive more than 10 seconds. After watching the last two rounds where both guys got perfect KO'd both times, my goal is not the last 10 seconds, my goal is to land one hit. Jack is here, Jack is on the attack, he takes to the stage. How's it going, man? I got no chance, but I'm gonna try and hit one. <laughs> <laughs> Will Jack have what it takes? Jack able to stomp some toes there early on, land a couple of attacks. But Chun Li comes on strong. Oh, but there's been a, a bit of damage dealt here on our pro. Ja oh, but back in the corner just where the pro wants you. Oh, but connects the massive attack. It's going to be a close round. Oh, but lands the attack Oof. for the KO, but we're going into round two, and it's anybody's game getting pummeled into the corner, connects it for well done, the man. nearly well perfect KO. <laughs> that went so much better than I expected. Honestly, I think it was mostly because I was just playing so dumb that I was kind of catching him off guard, but getting him down to like half-life on the first round, I will take that. I feel like he stepped it up a little bit for the second one. He was like, yeah, no, you, you had your fun. Get out of here. I heard your name. Well, I heard the bastardized version of your name. Yeah. I'm like, I, I wasn't going to try and make him do Shuxi with there. Like, I, that I, felt like I too heard much. The name and I'm like, 
with combo is gonna be my f***ing death. <laughs> there it is, man. GG's. Good luck in the rest of the tournament, man. Darvin Vendio, final call. You're about to be DQ. Darvin Vendio going once. I messed it up. So far, uh, been recognized a few times. Not a whole lot. I mean, like, I'm not wearing anything to give me away. Uh, but as I'm talking about it, that person right over there recognized me. Uh, but it, yeah, what's up? Taking a little pit stop before we go into Comic-Con here on day three. We're stopping by the uh, Dune Prophecy Activation here on West 37th Street. Uh, I have no idea what we're about to get into, but you know what? I'm excited to check it out. Check out this line, though. We got a lot of people here, uh, so let's get on in. Spooky. <laughs> right? like, kind of like overwhelming though. I wasn't yeah. expecting like an almost haunted house experience, yeah. but I was I was glad everyone was kind of you know moving slowly yeah. and chill. I appreciated that. Really? Like, that was a lot of fun though. That was cool. And uh, I got my ring. I think I got a size too large though. I might have to go back. Uh, and I'm now part of the sisterhood. So I'm ready to go. I'm ready to check it out when it comes out. Now I've got a little Easter egg for anyone who like thinks they recognize me. I just do that. But the problem is is uh, I'm, I didn't. I don't have a sharpie on me, so I gotta redraw it on every time I use the bathroom and wash my hands. And I feel like I'm seeing a whole bunch of people recognize me while they see me redrawing this back on. But it's okay. Gotta make sure we have our lazy cosplay. That is literally just me cosplaying as myself. It's all right. See, this is why we drew it on. It's a dance you Because I'm incognito. Really? And you got dishonor! Dishonor on you! Dishonor on your family! And dishonor on your cow! Shame! 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 <laughs> so much louder in person. You screamed so good. Sorry, <laughs> oh. How you doing, man? I get a picture. I don't wash my rice! It's not on you and your family! You're a cow! We found him, guys. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Perfect. That's it's so good to see you. Oh my god. Thank you. Dude, I literally, my friend Russell just did like a, he was like your guest on one of his things. Oh, like, nice. I'm the most jealous I've ever been. Let's go. And now I can tell him to suck it. I got you. Yeah. of this man's existence. This is Don. Don has seen my show several times. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, I'm pleased to report he has improved since last time. He has acquired the buttons on the vest. Uh, where did you get that? Because I need a new one, actually. Uh, I have email. I'll okay, yeah, yeah, email. So you went to X1 Whips, the guy who made the original Whips, and you got one made for yourself, am I correct? Yeah. But this is awesome. Yeah. He's got everything. You gotta get those knots out of the fall, man. That no, is I, bad for the whip. You can't have that. No, they, they keep tying themselves. Yeah, like, so you gotta untie them. It's gonna throw off the weight and then all that. Get those out before you crack it again. I know. Very important. Yeah, very important. But listen, I am very impressed with this. We've been trying to find this guy since Thursday, and everyone's like, yo, I found, I saw a, a cop 
cosplayer is you. And I'm like, what, what, where is this? Yesterday we were looking for you, couldn't find you. And then today, uh, I'm just getting lunch and I just hear someone go, hi, Jock. And boom, we got it. So here we are. We did it. All right, this is for me. Wait, which one? No, he's right there. <laughs> so that's three days of New York Comic Con in the books. Uh, saw some awesome stuff, uh, although I gotta tell you, I'm a little exhausted, I'm a little overwhelmed. Learned a lot of things that I'm gonna put into practice for my next con. Uh, more importantly, uh, making sure that I get a lot of sleep each night because I am exhausted and it's not even five o'clock. Uh, but saw some awesome cosplays, saw some awesome panels, uh, got to meet some awesome people, had a lot of fun. Looking forward to it next year again already. Toss a coin to your whipper, or maybe a twenty, or maybe a twenty.